Okay guys, uh, welcome back. Uh, in this video, I'm going to go over a uh, custom script I created to copy uh, DNS zones uh, from a Windows DNS server over to Azure. Alright, here it goes. So first, I I'm going to start off here in uh, DNS zone in Azure. See, I have no uh, DNS zone currently on this subscription. So I'm just going to go ahead and sign up from there for now. And then I minimize. Alright, so this is my DNS zone uh, on my Windows uh, server. This is the one I'm going to copy over to Azure. These are all the records in there. Um, <clears throat> I've already created a script that will be in Get, uh, GitHub. And um, I've already downloaded it here into my uh, temp folder. So what I'm going to do now is run the script. Uh, I'm currently on, it will be, uh, to run the script, uh, you can be on any server that has access to the uh, DNS records and the DNS zones. Uh, I'm currently on the actual DNS server, just to make it uh, easier, it preferable you're on that. Um, so let me navigate to where I copied my script to. And then I'll run the script. It needs three uh, input. The first one is the uh, DNS uh, zone that I want to copy. The next is the subscription uh, in Azure that I want to um, copy that uh, DNS zone into. And lastly is the resource uh, group name. Now this is not, it does, the resource group doesn't have to exist. Uh, if you give it a name and it doesn't exist, it will create one. Alright, and that should be it. Go ahead and run the script. As usual, it will prompt you for login. into Azure and it will copy the records over. Okay, uh, the script is done running. At the end of uh, the script, it will give you the NS records. Uh, these are the NS records you need to put into your domain registrar, uh, the person that hosts your domain, so that it will point Azure as the uh, naming server for that domain. All right, now that the script is done, your record should be in Azure. So let's go back and log into our Azure portal. All Okay, and once the Azure portal loads, let's go down to uh, DNS zones. All right, and we should have a uh, uh, DNS uh, zone that copied over 18 records in there. Let's go into that and just browse through them quickly. And these are the records that were copied over from our DNS server. You can uh, look at them, make sure they're right before switching your NS record on your domain register. And that is it. Simple as that. Uh, thank you for watching. You have a good day.